Hey everyone, so today I'm so inspired to do... You know, have you guys watched the K-drama Tales of the Nice Tail? I'm so in love with Dong Wook. <laughs> okay, but I'm also in love with that... Uh, what's that guy name? I can't remember his name. Rang. Okay, so in... Ki I think he's Kim Bong in, in that drama. So anyway, I'm going to teach you how to do Kim Yuri. I think in, in that movie, I mean in that drama, her name is Yuri. Uh, she's beautiful, she's a foxy little girl uh, um, assisting Rang in that movie, so in that drama. So I really love her outfits and her makeup. So today, right, I'm gonna do similar makeup uh, of what she is uh, wearing in that drama. So I'm gonna do it right now. So, first thing first, I'm going to do is I'm going to prep my skin which is the softener. This one helps me to soften the fine lines and wrinkles on my face and it helps me to double cleanse my face as well. So normally, if I want to uh, refresh my face, I will use, I will put it in a, I'll pour it into a, um, I pour this into a um, spray bottle like this and I spray. So it helps me to refresh my skin and then also um, I can use it to uh, do my makeup. So I realized that uh, if you realize, actually a lot of the Korean stars they put a lot, a lot of effort to taking care of their skin. For me, right, I also believe in taking care of your skin because you know, um, if you want to have good makeup, right, you can't just have uh, just use the makeup to cover your face, those uh, uh, the flaws that you have on your face, like the pimples, the blackheads, the uh, what do you call it? Scars on your face, right? You can't uh, salvage it. Yes, that you can't conceal it. It will still show off all the imperfections. So I always, always advocate on having good skin because um, it will really help uh, to you know make your makeup much more uh, adhere to your skin. As in, like the foundation will adhere to your skin better, and there will be no cakey foundations uh, that you will face. So after using the softener, right, so I'm going to use is, I am going to use my uh, eye cream, okay, because when you want to do your eye makeup, right, it's very, very important that you keep your eyes makeup much more, uh, your eyes much more moisturized and reduce fine lines and wrinkles so that your, when you put your concealer on your eye area, it will not clog as well. So many women think that, you know, oh, you know, I don't need to... Uh, uh, take care of my skin because um, you know I can use makeup to conceal not not really true and especially I know zoom right now right they um, they have this it's a joke actually I feel that they have this uh, makeup tool inside zoom so to me it's like I felt that it's an insult that you know are they making fun of women that are not able to do their own makeup and then they produce that tool I don't know to me it's an insult I felt so to me, I feel that makeup is a tool, makeup is a weapon for all of us to use. Uh, and then, you know, and we women should use, the make, should use the weapon because men don't have it. Only we have it, right? So that makes me angry. <laughs> okay, good. So next, right, I, I love to use um, and I also advocate, always advocate on good skin. You know, I have lots of friends who are in my 40s but they all look very good because I take care of their skin. So if you are interested for me to take care of your skin, right, uh, you can DM me. My details are in uh, below in uh, in this video, alright? So DM me and I will teach you how to take care of your skin. It's not a... Um, you no, know, rooms don't build overnight as well. So as to your skin, I didn't have such good skin until, you know, I really diligently doing my uh, doing my mask, doing my treatments, uh, using this product that I really love it. This one is a serum. This one is a facial oil. Uh, it helps to moisturize my skin. I'm already 43. Um, I mean, I don't do Botox. I don't do like fillers. So you know, so it really uh, shows very much on how you love your skin more and how you love yourself more. I felt personally that. Um, in order for all of us to have good skin, you need to be diligent in exfoliating and doing serums. Once you are 25 years old and above, right, you really, really need serum. And skincare is a lifestyle. You know, I felt that if you are actually um, cannot afford to have a good skin, then you must learn how to um, 
you know, women, right, if you learn how to earn more money, if you learn how to be independent financially, uh, if you learn how to uh, take care of a skin, how to um, uh, you upgrade yourself constantly, you are actually a very attractive woman. And don't be afraid that men will not be able to find you. Men will find you. You don't have to find them, all right? So you just enjoy your life, upgrade yourself, uh, you know, and then you will get, uh, they will come and find you. So you don't have to worry about that. So personally, I've gone through this. <laughs> I've gone through all these things. So I totally understand. Okay. So, um, so today, right, I'm gonna use this too. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna mix the serum and the oil together. Okay. One thing about the serum, um, it helps me to. Uh, it's a. It's a. It's made of. Alpen Rose is a hundred years old roses, and it's a never die rose. Right. That's why we call it never die rose. So hence, it's why. What will happen if you use it on your face? So your face skin cells will be rejuvenated and it's like food for your skin, you know, and then you will look younger and rejuvenated as well. So, you know, so I really personally love this one. And just use your oil, this infinity facial oil, you can use it for a massage as well. So personally, I love this one. It really helps me to look younger. And you can use it to firm up your skin. Because personally, I I love to do massage. So it helps me to firm up my skin, especially as we age, right? This part will have a lot of lines and your eyes area as well. So constantly, if you want a little bit of massage, you can, you know, if you have a lot of neck lines, this will help as well to reduce the fine lines and wrinkles in your face. Alright, mix right, I'm going to put on makeup already, I am... So I'm going to teach you how to have Korean luminous skin, okay? So I'm going to use this Honey Glow, this is my favourite, it helps me to give you that facial glow and then I'm going to use the Ivory uh, 110, okay? This one gives me that uh, facial glow and the uh, coverage that I need. I don't really usually need uh, foundation. Okay, but I need my primer. Let me find my foundation primer. That is very important for me. Okay, this is my foundation primer. I love it. So, for me, right, usually I mix together because I'm lazy. Uh, so, I mix together so to give me a good finish. So, just move downwards. So make sure I'm a I'm a hand person, so I use hand to blend my, my makeup. So you see once you have good skin, right? You blend even nicer. I really loved her makeup. She uses very nice um, concealer, I mean as in like um, contact lens. I just want to make sure that I blend my foundation properly. So I'm done. Next, I'm going to use my loose powder. I really love this loose powder. It has a bit of hyaluronic acid inside. So it helps to keep your face makeup much more long lasting. There, done. So next, I'm going to draw my brows. So brows are very important to shape your face. So especially for Koreans, right, their brows are very thick. So they look younger. And they love the glowy facial skin that the Asians uh, in Singapore, we call it the oily face. But actually, it's very glowy, it's very watery, very glass skin. So that's why it gives you that youthful looking skin okay so it's anti-aging so I'm done with my brows right now so I'm gonna use my mascara brush so my brush uh, this one will just help me to tune the color a little bit lighter so the front should be light the, the ending should be sharp okay so this is how you do your brows so I'm done so next right I'm gonna use my eye primer so just this eye primer, I love it. It helps me to make my eye makeup much more long-lasting. It's the best eye primer I ever use. Uh, so just use this one and then just dab at the brow, I mean the lash area, I mean the eyelids area. Okay. Alright. 
So in the show right, she uses a lot of smoky eye looks So I'm going to use my brown beige smoky base colour Okay, so I'm going to use a bit of bronzy bronzy Just like that bit of uh, shading so a light shader just in front Let's open up the eyes a bit Okay, next right, I'm going to put my highlighter just like that, simple and easy. I'm going to draw my eyeliner. So I just put a bit of gold in front here. So I'm going to draw a bit of so that my eye look bigger like this. Okay. So in the show, the eyeliner is very natural, so just draw in the yellow. Just like that. So you need to look foxy. So this is the foxy look, okay? So I'm going to apply my contouring powder. Just like that. And it's very important to use a bit of blusher. This blusher has a bit of a shimmery look but I personally love to use a lot of gold because when you want to, especially for Asian women, I think if you want to wear white right, you need a bit of gold on your highlighting uh, powder which is good. So I like to use this gold colour powder. So when you take pictures, it's easier, nicer as well. Goldish, goldish look. And then I'm going to use my highlighter. I like to use this overpowering highlighter powder. Just like that. Simple and easy. And then after that, right, I'm going to put my softener again to soften the look on the skin. Plus, my uh, makeup spray so that the makeup will last longer it will uh, make your makeup much more long lasting and dewy as well especially for your eye area so it will naturally make the eye makeup much more uh, what do you call that uh, blend properly all right cool so next right, i'm going to put my lipstick her lips is very pale in that um show so you know and then this one thing about this eye cream, it leaves your lips wrinkle free. Okay, next I'm going to use this the color. Very nice nude color lips. So when you have fair skin, then you can carry this kind of lip color. Alright good, so I'm going to change. So this is the final look. Just wearing a sequin and heels. Well, having suit with the, the younger boy. So I hope that you love this video. I look forward to seeing you soon in my next video. Bye!